Hey guys, it's Carly, and today I'm going to do my December favorites, and hopefully this will be up kind of soon because it's already kind of late. Yeah, and I think this year I'm not really going to do monthly favorites. I think I'll just do current favorites because my New Year's resolution was to kind of like start using this makeup that I have because I have a lot of makeup and I want to start using it instead of like buying all this other makeup and then kind of like forgetting about the stuff that I have kind of thing. So I just want to try to like use up most of what I have. I know I'm probably not going to use it all before I buy any makeup, but I'm going, to, I'm going to try to use up most of it. So I think I'm just going to start doing current favorites now, but yeah, so I'm just going to do this December favorites because I do have some things that I liked that I got in December. And yeah, so I'm just going to, going to get started with some face products. Um, this is something that I think I've had in my favorite videos before, but I got a new one and it's kind of different, so. Um, this is the CoverGirl, what is this, an aqua, aqua Smooth Makeup? I don't know, that's kind of like all it says. But, um, I had this in like the gray packaging, but the gray packaging for, was for like anti-aging whatever, but I'm not really old, so I don't really need that so I just got the regular one I didn't even see the anti-aging one anymore I don't really know if they make it but I got this one in a shade lighter yeah I got it in a shade lighter and this one's in ivory but it just looks like that and I actually have the sponge that comes with it it's like a nice quality sponge and then for a concealer I have um, this elf concealer which I think I've had in some past favorites videos but I kind of just like started using it again because um, I don't know why, but I just found it. I was like, oh yeah, I like this stuff. And basically this kind of like covers up, I forgot to say, but um, I kind of just put this over like in redder areas that tinted moisturizer doesn't cover up. And then like for under my eyes, I'll just use this concealer. I don't really like this highlighter that much. I don't really use it because it's like white. I really like white highlighters. I kind of like the champagne-y like colored ones, not like bam white so I don't know I don't really use that side but I really do like this side this is only three dollars so it's pretty good even though I don't really use this side but um yeah and then I actually have a brush favorite this month um I got this brush at a Santa game thing that we did a while before Christmas I don't know like December 1st like in the beginning of the month we did this thing called Dirty Santa. It's a game. I don't know if you've heard of it, but yeah, and um, I got this brush in this game, and um, it's just like a flat top. What is this? A flat top. It's just a powder brush from the studio line. That's all it says. Elf powder brush, but it's by Elf, and it was only like three dollars, and it's pretty nice. It's like really, really soft. Like if, it's, if it, you're buying a three dollar brush, brush, you might be like kind of skeptical like that could be not that nice but really this is like just as good as quality as like my eco tools brushes which are really soft too if you haven't touched to those before but um yeah i've just been using this for powder and then i have a blush which is also from elf three elf products in this thing but um i really like elf so um this is one of their studio line blushes in tickled pink and um so I'll open this. It's kind of got that NARS packaging thing going on, but it's a really light, pretty pink. And I've just been wearing this every day. I'm actually wearing it today, too. So, yeah, it's been like my new favorite brush. Blush. Blush. It's hard when you go from saying brush to blush because they sound like the same thing. Almost. And then, oh yeah, I forgot. I had a primer, too. Um, I actually got this NARS primer as a sample a while ago like probably in like September or something but I never really used it consistently enough to put in a favorites video like I'd probably use like once a month or something but um I've actually in December I kind of like started like using it quite a lot and it's almost gone but um I just thought this was a really nice primer um it's the NARS oil free pro prime and it just looks like that but it just, it's like a white primer. So, 
yeah, it's like that. Kind of squeeze some out. But, um, yeah, and a little bit kind of, like, goes a long way. So even though this is, like, this big of a tube compared to, like, a soft lips, lip chapstick, like, that's how they're, like, the same size. But, um, it's pretty small, as you can probably tell. But, um, since a little bit does go a long way, this has actually lasted a while, I would say. And it still probably has, like, that much left in it. Maybe. So, I really like this. It I can really tell a difference if I forget to use a primer. And then I use one. Then I'm, like, when I'm wiping my makeup off, I'm like, dang. It's a lot of makeup coming off, so it actually does make my makeup last longer, I've noticed. And then, for mascara, my mom took my Buxom Lash, ma Lash Mascara, which was in my November favorites. So... I didn't, I was too lazy to go, to go get it every morning. I was like, oh yeah, I need to get that mascara back. But I would just use um, this Benefit Bad Gal Lash Mascara. So I would just use that instead. But um, I really do like this mascara. Um, I like more of like the defined lashes. And this really does give you the more defined lashes. I'm actually wearing that today too. But it just has like this really gigantic brush. And, and then the last thing, I have a lip gloss, and this is from a uh, present that Lauren got me. It's, um, we exchanged this before Christmas, like a week before Christmas. It was actually my favorite lip gloss in that whole entire kit, because I've tried them out all. That lip gloss, they had like a bunch of different lip products in there. It was like the Give Me Some Lip Sephora Sampler kit thingy. But, um, this is the Smashbox lip gloss that was in there. And it looks like this, and I'm wearing it right now. And this is in Fame. So I'll just show you that. And it's just like, this is like the best lip gloss I think I've ever tried. Like, with drugstore ones and stuff including. I just like really like the consistency of this. It's really smooth and not sticky at all. So I really want to get some more of these maybe. Eventually I will, but I really do like this lip gloss. And it's just like a pretty like um pinky like plum color. It's a good berryish color, yes. That's going to be the word. It's a pretty berryish color. It's perfect for like the winter and fall times, I think. So really do like this. And this is like a really long favorites video, even though I didn't really think that I had that many products. But um yeah, so that's it. And I hope you guys liked this kind of last of the year favorites videos. I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.